Good morning, MHS. I'm Larry Sprinkle, and on this edition of MHS Rewind, we're covering a new phenomenon that's been taking over the school, parkour. Parkour is the act of moving through an area rapidly, typically done in an urban environment. They get through obstacles by running, jumping, and climbing. I'm here in an MHS hallway witnessing the parkour firsthand. So, how did you get into parkour, and why did Let you? me stop you right there. My group of parkours are the bad mamma jammas. We are the best in town. Let me put it this way, Sprinkle. We can do a wall jump, 720. Let me tell you, where's you? A Gordia Crunch Butter Biscuit, 720 flip. I can do a Double Decker World Cake Taco flip. That's weak sauce. Um, all right then. <coughs> we also seem to have another parkour group in the school, this one being led by Betty Browns. Betty, how do you feel about parkour and the competition surrounding it? Well, it's just a way to express our feelings and just, it means so much to me and my friends. All right. Well, there you have it. For MHS Rewind, hey, I... What the heck do you think you're doing in our hallway? This isn't your hallway. We're free to express ourselves wherever we want. No, this, we is, want. this is our territory. If you want, you're going to have to face us in a head-to-head -head battle. Ladies, you're on. Well, you heard it here first, folks. Seems that Team Bad Mamma Jammas and Team Betty Browns are going to battle it out in competition. Winners get the hallway and losers get, well, we'll get back to you on that. For MHS Rewind, I'm Larry Sprinkle. And remember to sprinkle your day with a bit of happiness. <laughs> this ought to be good. Are you guys thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, he's so strong. Um, team meeting. Cheryl! All right guys, we can't let him win. We have to have that hallway. Then what are we gonna do? I have an idea. What is it? We could take peas and put them under their beds like Princess and the Pea, and they will be tired and fall asleep at the competition. My pet fish, Sushi, could come up with a better idea than that. Well, I mean, we could try sabotage. Sabotage? Yeah, like, mess with them so they don't get as good as training as we do. I like that. Let's do it. I still think Sushi could do better, but whatever. Let's get to it.
All right, Hogan, come here. I think they're trying to mess with us. Well, I mean, what are we gonna do about it? Let's go talk to Swatowski and Brucey about it. What's up? Uh, guys, they're trying to mess with us. I think that we should try to- Try, try and uh, get back at them. Why would they do that? Probably because they just want that hallway. Yeah. So are you guys in? Okay, let's go. Woo! Time to do some laps upstairs. Let's go. within me. Lexi, how could you say that? I don't know what you're talking about. You know what you said. You know how sensitive I am. I literally have no idea what you're talking about. Poop head. Stupid. Freckles. Butt white. Girls. Weirdo. Ha, huh, last time I heard that one I fell off my dinosaur from laughing so hard. You didn't even have a dinosaur. Yes, I do. Girls, arguing is not the answer. Uh, guys? What? Houston, we have a problem. Oh no, let me see. Oh no. Ow. Ow, that hurts. I don't know how to do it. Do you think it's working? Yes. Okay guys, I just don't think this is gonna work by ourselves. I think we need to call in a trainer. What's the trainer gonna do for us? I don't know, but maybe keep us in shape and help us from getting our hands glued to anything else. Well, all right, who are we gonna call? I haven't thought that far yet. I think we should call this guy. Hello? Yeah, we're in need of a training session as soon as possible. Martinsville, yeah, the high school. Today? Great, thanks. See you then. Let's see how this goes. What are you waiting for? Let's get this party started. Who is this guy? Yeah, I don't know, but he looks nothing like he does in the flyer. Okay, I know. We'll just see how it goes. Let's get this started. What is this? <laughs> yeah. Excuse me, sir. I'm not trying to be rude, but... Listen, I'm just here to help you. So if you want to win, be quiet. 
Playtime's over, lady. Run, run, run! Better jazz hands than that. It's simple! We need a break. We don't take breaks in the parkour business, so go! Jeez, he's an angry little elf. Shh, Mia, you're gonna get us in trouble. No! I'm just all jacked up on Mountain Dew. Now the competition's in one day, and if you want to win, get your lazy butts up and let's go! We're here live from, uh, Martinsville High School, witnessing an epic event between two phenomenal parkour teams. Here behind me, we have Swatowski stretching. Oh, here you go. Yo, what's up? We out here, you know, about to get this up. But my boy over there is being all emotional for some reason. No one knows why. Dude, what's up? Why are you being so emotional? Just shut up. Just shut up, Brucey. Um, let's go check in on the other team. Guys, where's Betty? She's supposed to be here. Nobody knows. Besides, it's not like we need her anyways. She better be here soon. The competition is about to start. She better have a good excuse. Guys, wait. Oh, no, no. All right, let's take a look at the parkour rules. Let's see here. All teams must have four players, oh no, in order to compete in the competition. Well, it seems to me that if Team Betty Browns doesn't find a new player soon, they will have to forfeit. Give me that. It's the dumbest show I've ever heard. Come on, we need you, Loretta! We need you! That's gotta hurt. Ha ha. Looks like the teams are equal now. <clears throat> Alright, let's get back to the different moves and points you can score. You see, the main objective of parkour is to get from point A to point B, scoring as many points as possible. Different moves will score you different points, such as if you do the 360, you will get 5 points, and if you do the kick, you will get 1 point. Each player will be starting in different locations. The first location is a vocational wing, moving through the halls by the well stairs, reaching the checkpoint. However, when each player reaches a checkpoint, they must do a handshake in order to move on. Similarly, to a relay race in track and field, they will have to do the same in other locations until they reach the finish line. Trying to rack up points with various parkour moves each time, the team with the most points will be our winner. Now, let's get this parkour competition started. Let's get this parkour started!
Team Betty Browns is your winner. They're your winner. Woo! Oh. <sighs> However, it seems Team Bad Mama Jamas is going to have to face the consequences. I'm Larry Sprinkle, and remember to always sprinkle your day with a bit of happiness. <laughs> I guess this triple gordita, whatever the heck it is, didn't work, did it? <laughs> <laughs>